regardless of the results of this, I'm curious to see what the results will be when they play in the double elim bracket. I'm sure they will. Going with the green Incineroar this time. I think he's going to try and blend into PS2 so Enderman can't find him. Hi, Mario. Who's your money on in this set right now in the round robin? It's like a best of three. Mm -hmm. mm, I think Bencho's going to take it. Oh. I think I that's feel, fair. Especially. I feel like Bencho's been like upsetting Derek like early in bracket, and then Derek will come from losers and you know. Like, yeah, Derek's Derek will say, "I'm tired of this," and then yeah. oh, oh, oh he wow. lives anyway. I think Derek's Incineroar uppies go slightly further than the average Incineroar uppie. That's because he's doing the input, dude. It's like, <laughs> it's like Ryu uppie. <laughs> Trying to look up their set history right now. I'm curious to see who's won more sets. Uh, definitely Derek. Bencho didn't start winning until like pretty like like recently. Like recently in the grand scheme of things, okay. Uh, then we see Bencho kind of off stage. I, I'm assuming he's gonna save his diamond. I mean, I understand it, but also like you kind of have a pretty decent percent lead, so we'll see. But you know, Bencho can do a lot with just a, an axe. Okay, don't yeah. sleep. Uh, and especially he's been working on his nil combos a lot. Oh, okay, he's oh he does crap the diamond. Okay, oh okay he got a second diamond. Cool. I was gonna say he's like gonna have to park the bus pretty hard. But anyway, yeah, Vencho has been working on his nil combos, been hitting them, that's cool. Um, so Derek definitely has a lot more to contend with there. And that's another thing. Uh, I told Derek to stop going for those revenges because he just gets punished for them. And there's another example of him getting punished for revenge. I mean, at the same time though, you know, he hits one revenge at this point and then anything is gonna kill Steve. All of that will also kill Steve. I just, so I did find the, uh, the, game, the set count and they have played 70 times Ben shows has 19 and D Money has 51. They However, 70 times. 70 times. Well, I mean, when you meet at, in like that kind of hurts my feelings. Grand. I'm not gonna lie. Oh. I thought I thought I had more sets with Derek. That, that makes me sad. Okay. Well. Uh, but even though Derek has way more wins than Bencho, they have gone every other game. Like Bencho or Derek won, then Bencho, then Derek, then Bencho. Derek won their most recent encounter, though, which, honestly, yeah. they may have played two sets yeah, in they one did, night. Yeah, they did play two sets in one night, so I guess technically it was 1-1 one, one last time. That's a pretty cool rival rivalry, though. 70 sets, pretty even. Like, that's that's cool. Yeah, I think they'll, they'll like, play one set, and whoever loses figures something out, and then they'll just, like, 3-0 sweep the next game, or the next set, and then it just keeps switching between there. Yeah. And Derek evens this up, game one. Yeah, wow, evened up. Uh, Ventro doesn't even have diamond, but he does have gold. Oh, there he spends it for the, uh, the minecart. Mm. How gimpable is Incineroar with the blocks? Like, if, Inc if Incineroar has to recover low? Um, yeah, pretty gimpable. I don't think... Because, like, if you just put the blocks, like, if he has to go low, there's not really much you can do. But he can do the double jump, like, up air thing, like, to, like, destroy some blocks, but... Yeah. But, I mean, to be honest, at, at that point where he's already used that many resources, most characters would kill him anyway. So I don't think True. Steve block in general is that, like detrimental to Incineroar. Well, you were saying earlier about telling Derek not to do those revenges. I feel like at the same time, though, that's, like, gotta be Incineroar's game plan in this matchup because just stat-wise and tier list-wise, like, Steve just, just would destroy him. Like, he's just gotta get those big hits if he can. Uh, yeah, maybe. I don't know. When we were watching his VODs, he was definitely fishing it for way too much in situations where he could be doing other things like Nair and keeping, you know, because, like, even you, you don't need revenge to win this game because if you're just you know using your nair and your good walling tools to uh deprive steve of resources then that's still a pretty good strategy and the thing is too look at once he has revenge he basically has to sit back and let Vencho do whatever because the more he uses his moves the faster the timer runs down uh which actually is something i didn't know about incineroar until like yesterday did you know that i didn't it's a minute and if he whiffs moves like that the timer goes down see Interesting. Yeah, we were doing like a we we're doing like a Min Min Incineroar like matchup discussion in the group chat or whatever, and like the Incineroars were telling us. I was like, what the heck? I didn't even know that. But yeah, but anyway, yeah, this is pretty even. Honestly, this is like low key a, like a winning position for Incineroar right now. Yeah, I mean they're both basically one hit away from dying. If Bencho gets one smash attack, it's over. Derek hits anything at this point. There, yeah, there like go. that. That was really over. good. Yeah, and, and he, he knew he could overextend like that because he had the iron block there. You know, if he missed, he could like, reset onto it. That was smart. And, you know, that's going to matter a lot more than, like, usual just because it's going to be a best of three. 
So we got Vencho, you know, doing it's the thinker pose, bro. Yeah, what adjustments do you think he's gonna make in this next set? Or next game? Um, let's see. He went Enderman. Oh, that's a good adjustment. Or no, he went he went he Enderman, Enderman last time. Okay. He did tell me he did tell me that he uses like the Steve skins to like signify how he should be playing. Mm. But I'm not gonna like reveal his secrets there. Interesting. He told me, but I wasn't really listening to be honest. I was, I was looking at my phone. Yeah, right before you got in here, I was saying I wonder if Derek went green and Cinero to blend into PS2. A little bit to hide from Enderman. Yeah, I, I, okay, I'd actually, I don't know what Derek's um, thought process is, is on picking the alts, or if he's just like, oh, I, you know, I like Incineroar, so all the alts are cool. Uh, but this is this is his, like, I feel like this is Derek's alt, right? Yeah. Like, you would say that this Incineroar is, like, his like his alt. Oh, for sure. Yeah, so the, the, he definitely, it's game time. Uh, Derek going for the down tilts, the nares off stage. That could have been dangerous, but, ooh. Bencho is definitely already seeming to go for more of those oh, they're games. They're the blocks, they're the blocks, and, yeah. Yep, no. As we were talking about earlier, about how Gimpable yeah. is Incineroar. Yeah. He's that Gimpable. The thi yeah, the thing is about uh, Kalos is you can't do the tech where you like ride the wall and go like, like the blocks with yeah. your up B. So yeah, this is a really good pick from Bencho. And the fact that he already has iron tools on deck is really big. Do you get a lot of metal from Kalos too? It, it is a metal stage, yeah, yeah. So you pretty much only get metal and stone from it. But the mining speed is slower. So like personally me, I don't like this stage, but Bencho really likes it. What do you think Derek banned? Uh, what did Derek ban? He probably banned, I would guess, like, Battlefield, Small Battlefield, definitely FD. That's what I'm assuming. Whenever I watch sets like this, I, because we can't see what they banned, I'm always just kind of interested in what the mindset is behind those. Actually, he might have, he might have banned, actually, okay. I think he did Small Battlefield, Hollow Bastion, and FD. That would be my best guess. Because I feel like, I feel like Incineroar does really actually like Battlefield quite a bit. Did you see that block place on reaction because he knew he was going to get spiked there? Yeah. And again. Kind of stall, though. Yeah, I don't see how Incineroar is meant to win on this stage because the, if he has to go low, he's dead. And Bencho can just sit there and camp down there, and it's, like, not worth it for Derek. And he might be oh dead here. Oh, my gosh. Yep. And there you go. Okay. I, I thought that was a 2 out, but okay. That's yeah. Good. yeah. Yeah, no. Almost a JV3 stock there. We'll see what kind of adjustments Derek can make. Derek just needs to ban this stage. I don't think... <laughs> yeah, yeah, don't go back there. Yeah, I don't think there's any reason and Sonora should be going Kalos versus Steve, because the only the only time you should go Kalos versus Steve is if you play a character that can deal with walls good enough to yeah. where you can, like, punish him. You know what I mean? Like, you can actually, like, force him to do something other than mine. Yeah, and the other thing is, like, again, in this matchup, I feel like Incineroar has to kill Steve at, like, 50 at some point. And on a, such a big stage, that's going to be really hard to make, act, make happen. Yeah, and it's also the fact that, like... Like, in, okay. like Steve gets his good resources so fast on that stage. You know what I mean? Like yeah. iron is such a like iron compared to like stone or gold makes such a huge difference against mm -hmm. iron. Okay, so again, thinking about those bands, Vencho let Derek go to town and city. Whenever I think about playing against Incineroar, it doesn't matter what character I'm playing. That's the first stage that's gone. Why do you think he left that up in here? Um. That is actually an interesting question. I wouldn't take it to the stage, especially not a I don't, especially not a Steve. It's so hard to get like meaningful resources on this stage too, because it's all wood. Like that Steve's at kill percent right now. Yeah. One wrong move, he gets side beat. It's then, over. Yeah, and then look at because because the, the stage is a lot longer. It's a lot like okay. Oh well, my god. Got it anyway. But what a character. It, yeah, it is a lot harder to get those jab chains going because it's just a longer stage. Uh, but you know what? Vencho's making do with wood. Mm-hmm showing us that it really doesn't matter what material he has. Uh, he's gonna kill Incineroar at 20 either way. And there, there's the iron. Okay, this is gonna get out of hand, I feel yeah, like. Yeah, I, I predict us seeing Derek throwing out more of those revenges because he's probably thinking, I have to kill this Steve right now. You do have to kill Steve right now before he gets diamond. Otherwise, yeah. I think this is over. Oh, Ooh, there he's going. He's he going for those side pieces. And there okay, you go. There go. One, yeah. one fair. I don't know if that was bad DI, but... Like, I wouldn't be surprised if that killed, I think but that he, I think like he was holding angle. out. Yeah, he was holding out because he was trying to, like, get behind his wall. That's unfortunate, but, I mean, for Derek fans, that's definitely <laughs> uh -oh. what you want to see. Uh-oh, no combo here? Okay, he went for it. Oh, oh, uh-oh. Definitely could have killed him. It's all right, though. Create your weird little walls, Vencho. Yeah, one thing that Vencho does that I don't see many Steves do is he does those staircase-esque walls, and those are really hard to get past. Especially when like some of like the inside blocks of the staircase, yeah, double reinforce the ones on the outside. It gives him that much more time to actually react to what you're trying to do. 
Yeah, the uh, the only Steve's I've seen do that are like Venture and Radacious, to be honest. Most Steve's just keep it basic. Even Aquila does. Like, he keeps it very basic. Uh, and, ooh, I would expect an up smash there, to be honest. I could have done. Once again, I think we're at that spot where Derek. Oh my god. Ben Derek, Cho just wasted, yeah. like, okay, well, Derek wanted to end it there and paid See, for that's it. the thing about revenge. He gets revenge, but then you have to win neutral again. Like, you're essentially yeah. winning twice. Kind of and thing. we got the down tilt scoop. I personally don't think Incinero deserves that, but he definitely needs it in this matchup, so. Get him. But this is exactly how we like a best of three set. Last stock, game three. Yeah, who's gonna cheese the other first? That's yeah. If, yeah, look, yeah, he Steve's wants to jab. Yeah, Steve's Derek, got get diamond. away from that jab. It's not good for you. Oh, no, oh. Derek. That Derek. Nair is so fast out There's, of shield. Derek, don't approach. Oh, no, see? Derek. Oh, he did. He could... oh, my God. Oh, he's... There's, like, literally no reason to approach. Steve already has diamond. Like, yeah, just... Time him out, Derek. Yeah, literally time him out. You could time him. He's down in city. There you go. Nice. Look, like, stop. Another opinion? I think you should have to make the sound when you do the Incineroar neutral B like that. Oh, don't say that. He used to do that. <laughs> <laughs> I love that, though. I'll never forget the first time Derek uh, played oh me in a set, God. and he side beat me, and he saluted as he was side being. I almost didn't come back. Okay, this is, this is this is a this is a scenario where I do agree. Like revenge is good. You know what I mean? Because yeah, like, Bencho has a fear of God. Yeah. Basically, whoever wins this next neutral interaction is going to be sitting pretty. Ooh. Uh -huh. the timer's going down. That was a move. There we go. Oh, 122. See, now I, he's got revenge, he's, he's got side B on his mind. He hits that anywhere on this stage right now and Bencho's dead. And. <laughs> Dude, this is such a scary position as Steve, I'm not gonna lie. And yeah. the forward air. Yeah. He's got that revenge and it gets it done. All right, I'm gonna go beat Derek quick. I'll be back. All right, uh, have fun.